Welcome back to Scorecard Collectibles. My name is Dave and on today's episode we're going to be taking a look through my Select 2020 Dominance Complete Collection. This is everything I got. I've opened up one box on camera as well as five random packs um, but before I started my channel I already opened up one box um, before that. Um, so it's been requested a few times so I thought we would open up my Dominance album and see what everything looks like um, as, a, a, as a whole collection. Uh, I am going to go through the commons, because um, the commons look so great, but I will put up a time signature um, around here um, where you can skip to if you don't want to sit through the commons um, and just want to get to the, uh, the inserts. But I am going to just slowly go through um, all of the, the commons as well, because they are just absolutely beautiful looking cards. And it's nice to see them all together. So, we've got our Adelaide, and we've got our Brisbane. So they are 12 cards per team, um, including the, the logo card. And it is looking so nice. And there's the blues. We've got the pies. Go pies. That's, it's, I'm glad that it starts off um, a, full, a full page. Very nice indeed. And it does have an Adam Trelaw card. Um, yes. Um, and then we've got our Essendon. Looking all very nice. The red is it nicely pops. Um, we've got our Fremantle. Oh, very nice. And we've got the the cats. You know, Gaza with his last card. And then you got the GWS Giants. You want to get more colourful than orange? Try red with the Gold Coast Suns. Look at that, you need sunglasses, it's so bright. It's looking very cool. Let me turn the colour down a little bit to the, the gold of Hawthorne. These cards are looking very, just, they, they just look so fancy and, and special. And we've got the Melbourne Demons cards. Very nice. And then we've got good old North Melbourne. Kangaroos looking all very relaxing with that serene blue. Very nice. And then you've got Port Adelaide. Those cards look great. Especially because most of them are wearing the, the, the mostly black um, Guernsey in shorts, and that just looks so good on that. Um, on that, is that teal? I think it's teal. I could be wrong, but I, but it just is a very calming color, and it just it just pops with all that black in front of it. It looks so good. And speaking of black, you got the yellow and black from Richmond, from Tigerland. Very nice. Look at all of that. And then we've got our St Kilda. They had a very good season. And, uh, and then we're continuing with the red. With the Sydney Swans. Second last we've got the West Coast Eagles. And continuing that blue, we've got the Bulldogs. And that is the common set for Select Dominance 2020. Now, so these are the holographic parallels. Um, these look so awesome. Um, now, so. I actually worked something out 
I got two boxes and in both of those boxes I got the same teams for the holographic parallels. I In box one I got one Adelaide, I got one Brisbane, I got one Carlton, I got no Collingwood, um, which is why I had to buy those. Um, and then in the second box I got an Adelaide, I got a Brisbane, I got a Carlton, and it just continued like that. So and wait until I get on to the On The Rises, because there's a very weird story about that. Um, but yeah, so I didn't get any... Oh no, actually, I got the Varco. We got the Varco in the um, in the five um, random packs, but in the two boxes, I got no Collingwood. Um, so I have gone online, and I got the, um, the Team Logo card. I got the Pendles card, and... Um, mail day, this just came in the post, um, so I haven't had a chance to put it in, but I got, let's we'll just pop those there and keep that for a moment, um, but I did just get the Jamie Elliott and the Jeremy Howe to add to my collection. Um, I got them pretty cheap, so you can buy a set, um, but every time I've checked they are quite expensive um, so I've just got um, I've been sort of buying here and there and you can get some really good bargains um, so it's going to be a, a, bit, a little bit more work um, you know picking them off one by one um, but I reckon I can do it for a lot cheaper um, but you know if I can't look I'm, I'm happy to have these few um, cards but I'll pop them in later um, and then we've got the acid, and the acid looks so good. That red just really pops. Um, then we've got our Fremantle. Um, then we've got our Geelong. We've got two Geelong plus the one from the uh, random packs. I got five random packs. Um, we got our GWS. We got two Suns cards. You know, it just it just continues like that. We got two Hawthorne, two uh, Kangaroos, two Bulldogs, and two Eagles. Um, and I should have put them around the other way. That was a, uh, yeah, that's my mistake. But they, even the back look so good. But they just, oh, they just look awesome. So yeah, it was a bit of a weird, tricky thing with the, the boxes. Um, but yeah, wait until you find out what happened with uh, the On The Rise cards, because something really wacky happened with that. Um, the All Australian cards. I have decided, let me try to turn this around without knocking everything over. Um, I did decide to put them in order of team alphabetical order, um, just because I like doing that. I see all sorts of people doing their albums however they like. It's all our pre personal preference. And then we've got, um, just finishing off that, um, the All Australian set. And then I'll move that around again. To our On The Rise cards. Now, so in my very first box, I picked those On The Rise cards. Now, they might look familiar because they are literally the same cards I pulled on camera from my second box. These cards came in my first box. I pulled literally the exact same four On The Rise cards in my first and second box. That is crazy. Um, I haven't checked what numbers they are. Maybe I'll do that. Maybe I'll just go and grab them and see what, whether they're sequentially numbered. Okay, so these are the cards that I pulled in the second box. As you can see, they are literally the same. Um, let's flip this over and see what numbers we've got. Um, Okay, so we've got, okay, 270 and 147, so not sequential. Um, for Tim Taranto, okay, we've got 245 and 140. That's not 
Ed Richards, 297, we've got 112. And then for Fiorini, what did we get? Okay, we got 26 um, when I put him in first video. Um, and then 325 in the second. So the numbers are not the same. Um, but somehow I ended up with exactly the same four on the rise cards. Um, which is disappointing. Um, so I ended up buying um, this Josh Dacos on the rise. And uh, Jaden Stevenson came along with him. <laughs> um, but no, it's that's cool. And in my old day, I also picked up this Callum Brown on the rise uh, for pretty cheap. So I'm happy just trying to pick up what Collingwood cards I can from Dominance um, whenever I see a bargain. Um, and then we come to the draft, uh, the rookie cards. Um, I did just pick up that Trent uh, Bianco uh, from um, eBay, um, but these were the, the draft rookie cards that we got. Um, from my boxes um, and then we also I've just popped in here the um, checklist card as well as the holographic parallel checklist card which does actually look pretty cool um, so that's not all we got our super super special cards um, here they're all nice and cared for in their top loaders we got our, these were one per box. Um, we did get the, so these are the Premiership cards. Uh, got the 2002 Brisbane Premiership card, uh, number 84. Um, not the best um, game I really want to commemorate because uh, the Pies lost that grand final. So, um, yeah. Um, yeah, <laughs> that's... <laughs> Yeah, they could have got a better card, but they do look really cool. And then uh, we got the Hawthorne 2008 card. That was number 29. Um, let's pop that over there. Um, we got two medal uh, winners. We got the Sam Walsh NAB Rising Star 2019 card. And we also pulled, so that was from the first box. And we pulled another Carlton medal winner we got uh patrick cripps's afl players association most valuable player card um these are i think i think they're like one in 90 something packs so but they're not numbered um but they are rarer than the premiership cards so um no those look really really cool um and it's kind of neat that they're both from the same team so bit of consistency there um, and then finally finally our signatures our players ink signature um, if you've watched the dominance opening you've you've seen this this is our Aaliyah card uh, 89 of 175 um, but what you didn't see that I didn't open on camera was this Ben King uh, players ink signature card um, very nice indeed and that was 87 of 175 um, and it's cool that the the um, they're like mirrored images like Ben's on the right the Leah is on the left and it's all I know that looks really cool I didn't notice that until now because I've just always uh, never compared them side by side. But those are the autographs. Um, they're the special, the super special. So we didn't get anything mind-blowingly rare, um, but I'm very happy with the Dominance release. Still so uh, disappointed that I got the exact same on the Rise cards. Um, cause I really like, I really like the on the rise cards and just getting the exact same ones 
is those doubles are so weird so random thank you so much for watching um that does it for select 2020 dominance i'm don't, I'm not going to get my hands on any more cards. I will be buying um, sort of opened stuff um, if I can get them for cheap. Um, any Collingwood cards I can add to my collection. Um, but as it goes for opening up packs, that's it. Um, and I will do a um, album uh, review for my select Footy Stars um, collection, um, as well as I've. Um, most of my team coach I've opened off camera because I opened it earlier in the year. Um, but I have ordered a box of 2020 team coach to try to complete at least my common set and see what specials we can get. So we'll be doing a team coach album review as well as, um, opening up those packs. Um, hopefully, um, in the next few weeks. Um, so that will be something fun to look forward to. Uh, until next time, stay cool, take care, stay awesome. I'm Dave, this is Scorecard Collectibles, and I'll see you next time. Happy about that. Um, that was pretty cheap as well. Oh, we almost lost the camera.